Did you know that you can get a free replay tool to backtest synthetic indices and all other tradable assets offered by the leaf? Uh, well, uh, Delive has a free market replay tool on one of its trading platforms called Delive C Trader. Although most of you could be knowing it as a copy trading platform, on PC or laptop it has more other amazing features than you think. And one of those is the market replay tool <laughs> traders use to backtest their strategies completely for free. So without wasting your time, let me open my Delive C Trader app. You can as well download it from Google or use the web browser if you don't want to download it. However, I will leave the link in the description for quicker and easier access. We are here on uh, the Live C Trader while I'm waiting for the network to load all features. On the Live C Trader interface, you can expand this chart layout uh, from here. You can see uh, how it's now giving you a better view of the chart layout. And if you prefer the original chart uh, layout, you can as well uh, click here again and you can see how it looks like all right this is how the interface looks like and now uh you can see this left panel all right i will make a whole video about uh how to use this platform you can even see the top uh, panel you can see the right uh, panel all these uh tools you will have to know how to use uh them for the betterment of uh, your trading not only that even how you can uh, make money with this platform it is the same platform that has uh, copy trading here all right but as i said that uh, this uh, video is intended to let you know about uh, its market replay tool that you can be using to backtest your uh, synthetic indices so this is the market replay tool and I'm on volatility 10 index on H1. If you want to change the asset, you can uh, change it as well. You can go here on the expand sidebar, the three bars at the top or left corner. So click there. And if I go here on uh, all symbols right here, you can see that I can search for any symbol I want. But before I search it, you can see the step index 300, 400, volatility 15. Uh, 1s then uh, volatility 30 1s all those uh, assets are there uh boom 600 crash 600 so let me look for maybe um boom 500 eh? boom 500 you hit oh before i hit search it is already here so i can select that one okay and you can see uh it is here if i want to leave this one let me click here so that uh, this side back can go back okay you can see it has gone back all right so this is the boom 500 if i want to change the time frame i can as well change it from here uh, for example let me change it to can I either choose two hours three hours and uh, if you want more you can scroll this one okay scroll it and i can take it four hour Okay, once I'm done, click outside that and it is gone. Eh? Yeah, yeah, you can see that uh, Boom 500 is creating uh, something like a head and shoulder. So this is the left shoulder. And if I drag this one, this is the head because it is uh, having the height downwards than the left one. So this is uh, the right shoulder. And uh, if I pull out another... Um, trend line this is our neckline if you want to delete it you bring the cursor just there and right click then you go here to delete and let me do the same for each of these ones as i highlight and uh, then I right click and delete like that like that until all of them are gone let me drag the chart uh, from the left to the right so that i can get uh, my starting point back a test so what you do you are going to click on this market replay tool click on it and once you click on it it's going to bring this uh this uh, vertical line i hope you can see it so the moment i bring it here tap there and uh, you will see this will pop up okay, this one will pop up market replay true market replay delivery trader 
The market replay feature is designed to test the performance of your trading strategies based on uh, historical market data. Market replay allows you to experiment with different approaches in a secure environment. The feature works as an analytical tool and does not affect your trades or balance in any way. Then I can click on start. What is so, so crucial is here, speed. It is uh, 10,000 times speed. Brother faster so i will show you how you can reduce that one so you click on start that is loading historical market data which means it's going to first cut off all these ones mm -hmm. so once we cut them out we can begin from here to see uh, how we can test uh, the market rather how we can uh, back test the market you can see it has taken me to a different window and uh, you can as well see the market is already playing out right so we, this is the speed you can see it's already playing but uh, we can reduce this speed or we can even increase it so let me increase it to 500. i think how it is now moving slow so what if i increase it once again you can see two i think ten thousand uh-huh 50. i think so let me increase it again you can customize the chart uh, by squeezing the candles and expanding them using the right panel and the bottom panel okay, so let me maximize this window okay so when i maximize this window this is how it looks like so let me do some technical analysis i uh, pull the rectangle tool mark this order block as the support zone yeah or you can as well mark uh, this law by the way you can increase the thickness of this trend line by moving the cursor on the trend line right click and this option will show up huh? so if i increase it to here you can see it is uh, thicker okay you can see the market has not yet broken this high so let me show you let me pick the trend line to mark the high change the color if you want like to red you can as well uh, draw a rectangle tool around this order block right uh, then let me continue playing the market and see which side of uh, liquidity will be taken first okay let me make it faster okay you can see price has taken the downside liquidity and it is going to take the upside liquidity price is going to clear all this liquidity let me extend this one let me extend it you can see you can see you can see all right so this is liquidity which was lying there and uh, they had to first grab this uh, liquidity down below and then price had to go for this liquidity if price uh, breaks this high that's a sign that is going to continue its uptrend and then therefore let me play and see uh, if it will break it or oh, it has already broken the high and therefore the trend has continued upwards so since this one has been uh, violated let me delete it eh? okay let me extend uh, this line so that means price is willing to continue so this was just liquidity so from there you know, the reason for backtesting you can learn the reason price consolidated above here was to trap traders okay uh, when price does this one usually it wants to trap uh, traders who want to trade against the 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 directional bias which is the trend and uh, from here you can see the uh, price has been making higher highs and higher lows and uh, this was the low this is where liquidity was and another liquidity was here okay because the major high was this one so uh it had to first grab this liquidity by deceiving that it is going to go down and as you can see it didn't come to my support zone eh? rather it just grabbed this liquidity and uh, actually stopped here let me show you it just used this zone and uh voila it had to continue the upward movement let me continue playing the market and then uh, mark this low right and uh, play 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 and adjust the uh your technical analysis accordingly eh? And you see it is uh, congesting around this zone without a, like a weak or a candle to take it out to oppose to grab your stop loss and move in a different direction oh be careful 
first way to see this congestion because it's trying to you know grab the illiquidity so let me see because why i have marked this week if i go to h1 you are going to find that there's um, another block there let me see what he's going to do sometimes price can leave uh, without taking the liquidity which means to uh, deal with it in the future too. so whenever you see that congestion you have to be vigilant uh, and more especially when he first grabs the upside liquidity then prints this uh, bearish candle you can enter a sell or you wait eh? the safest way is to wait to break the laws okay then when he retests you can enter from what was previously our support zone and you can target the nearest law okay oh price actually went to the extreme support zone we had area marked okay so when price reaches to your support zone you have to begin planning for buys however be vigilant once again do not simply enter a trade without uh, any liquidity grab and liquidity grab can be inside or whether internal or external for this case uh, price has not yet grabbed the internal and when it grabs the external that means it will violate it will violate our um a rectangle tool which is our support zone and it will actually kick out or take out all the stop losses that are within mm, below this support zone then after that then it can begin planning for uh, an upward movement to continue its trend okay and you can see actually this is what happens so always back test as you are looking at or comparing your thoughts your direction of bias and what price has actually done in this way in a short period of time you are going to see how uh, your knowledge is uh, amplifying okay when you continue back testing the markets all right and uh, the other tools actually i didn't talk about is uh, these ones i can pause the market i can play okay and i can as well stop okay can stop the replay here i can use fast forward one bar fast forward one bar which means i can replay one bar at a time for example let me do this mm -hmm. so with one bar you click once as it forms click once as a bar forms click once as t forms that's how you use the one bar so let me reduce the speed so that i can play it uh, again let me play the whole of it mm, you can see all right 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 so let me stop you can stop here then i can play it again to have a recap of uh, where we started from and uh, it will stop at uh, the current market okay so that's actually the delive uh, seed trader uh, platform giving you the free market replay to backtest your strategies and uh, it is not only synthetic indices you can backtest all the other tradable assets on the leaf including currencies crypto the stocks among others so it is there for you at your fingertips to utilize and backtest your strategy so if you like uh, this video kindly subscribe turn on the notification bell icon for more upcoming uh, videos as I promise to you i'm going to bring more videos more especially about uh, this delivery C trader all right until next time see you a nice weekend